everything is my upcoming way. I don't define you. I don't work out everywhere they find you. I don't know say you sit down here. Will they cry? <gasps> Greetings first. I can't forget that one. How are you doing? Eh. Yeah. I don't think so they find me. How I won't take they find where my upcoming queen will they happy. You know, say I never chop since two days now. I don't eat food because you know happy. And I don't they ask you waiting, they worry you, that's where they trouble you. You know, greet tell me. And you might come forget, say, problem where they share like this, eh? The thing don't they have solved. If you tell me now like this, now I will look for solution, solve them for you. Oh, yo, yo. My upcoming queen. You know you're my friend and you have your way of getting whatever you want from me. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, it's about the prince. Peto, prince, your upcoming husband. Yes. What did happen? He beat you. No, I can't. You know, go try him. I will change him for him. What happened? Well, the prince invited Yvonne and I for a meeting where he did a formal introduction. Mm -hmm. And he introduced me to that intruder as just his childhood bestie and introduced her to me as his fiance. Hey! Ajalie! I hear you well, so. You say, fiancé, you, bestie, hey, wait up, this way they tell me now, you don't tell me. Yes, I have. Yeah, what did she tell you? She said um, I should not worry myself that everything is under control. Hey, it is a rap be that. Queen don't tell you say everything they under control. You no trust Queen. Everything waiting for this palace. If they under Queen control, she the controller. Why you can't worry yourself? Eh? You think so? I no think so. I no like that English thing. I know so. I know so. Where's the prince? Uh uh. Forget prince. Queen go handle him. Now you dey hear the the the, the persons. See eh? Hey! Laugh. Oh, you, you. Laugh. I can make you laugh more. <laughs> he gave this song, eh? Wow, I learn this dancing step. Hey! You don't tell why I want that song for you. They call him um, Malia Dance. <laughs> I think say now, now the best time I got that song for you. You need that. You know, since I carry small radio. Yo, if I carry that big one, they go catch me. Make I dance song for you. You need to be jolly, oh. Wait, my plan for you. Just a little silly. Nikki. Hey. Papa, you my mind, you pack me. I feel it, I feel it. Hey. What did you do? Say, say. Oh, but this is enough, it's so good. making that nauseating noise. That must be Oyoyo, the chief cook. Always all over my lady Ella, parading herself, dancing around. Wait a minute. Did you just address that commoner as my lady? In your life. Do not try that again. Do you hear me? Yes, my lady. Now go call that thing. She thinks this palace 
is a nightclub where she's allowed to parade and make noise as she likes. I will teach her a solid lesson. Go, go her. Again, when you go there, do not for any reason whatsoever address that commoner as my lady. You get that? Yes, my lady. Call her by her name. Do you hear me? Yes, Call lady. her by her cast name. Yes, my lady. As she wishes. She think you are wise. Don't conclude until God confirms it. Who knows the mind of God? Whatever He says must come my to pass. I learned that massage, you know. I learned it. Like that, I want go chinko. I want go China. They say that they do it like this. They bring go the camp. If they come, what I know they Ella? come. If they come. Starting when? How dare you call me by my name? Mm -hmm. um, my lady Yvonne instructed that I do so. You are very, very stupid. So Yvonne instructed you to call me by my name and then you came here to do so. <clears throat> you will have me to face. Where is that arrogant girl? Um, she's at the balcony. Yeah, need your service at me. You the grace, stand here, you the talk to one worker. If I leave you like this, now you go work out. Eh? Your lady, Yvonne, call you, make you call me cook now, your generation, and then be cook. If I say you don't lose, I know get respect. Say you don't join that um, idiotic, uh, lunatic, idiotic, that Yvonne, when no get man at all at all, you don't join her, they sort people. Abby, you don't grow. <laughs> Wait! I don't get what I want to Shut up! No, they talk. If I won't talk, no, they talk. Shut up! Make I talk. Eh? Don't worry. Very soon, my lady, they will crown her the first queen, the greatest queen of this kingdom. I go tell her, may she sack you. You know, saying amigo be how no. I go tell her, may she sack you from this lawyer palace. You go come up for here. You, you know what? what? I smell jealousy. Mm? <laughs> <laughs> see who they talk. They, they smell jealousy. You don't see person where say jealousy they smell. Eh? I smell your, your, your stupid head. I smell your anus. Be like saying no guess. Wait, wait, wait. Now me just insult. They, they smell jealous. Let them flip my head. Even how dare you instruct the medics to address me by my name instead of the title? How dare you? Because the last time I checked, you are still a common. Are you talking to me about title? Have you earned one for yourself yet? Well, it's a question. You know, I, sometimes I wonder what you're still doing here in the palace. Because the last time I checked, my man, the prince, already spelled it out to you in black and white. That you are nothing but a total stranger in this palace. Look, woman, you better watch your mouth before the Queen Mother throw you out on the street where you rightfully belong. You better watch it. Oh, wow. The Queen Mother. I see. The Queen Mother has pegged her. I tell you something. Both of you are going to lose out greatly. Yes. Don't you ever, don't you ever in your entire life call me names again. Ella or whatever stupid name they call you. You know, I see you really like creating things. But I won't, I won't oblige you. Yes, I know what you're looking for. But I need to remind you in case you've forgotten that this is a royal palace. Not your poor parents' touch house. Where you are allowed to display your madness however you like. Oh yes, this is a royal palace. If you want to run mad, You've got the markets where local Ekuke dogs like you are allowed to display their madness. I understand. But I tell you something. When you don't want to know about Ekuke, take an Ekuke to a castle. It will still remain what? An Ekuke. Ivan! I double dare you, bitch! I double dare you! On your father's grave, I double dare you! You are testing my patience. Even you are testing my patience. You are testing my patience. What 
you guys just said about a cookie dog <laughs> and a cookie so the cast mm. to still remain what? A cookie. <laughs> no, you guys need to shout it. To still remain what? A cookie. <laughs> nice one. Why do you two want to turn this palace into a battlefield to the extent of instigating the palace aides? Shouting at your voices. What has come over you? What? Well, my queen, I was sitting pretty, minding my business, when she came backing at me like a mad dog that she is. No, Are she... you backed back? She was the one who instigated the maidens to disrespect me. She Stop was the down. one. Enough. This is so embarrassing. Like my mother said, this is a palace and should be regarded with orderliness and decency. Do you want people to make mockery of us? Both of you should listen to me. I don't want to ever see this repeat itself again. Have I made myself clear? Yes, my friends. Yes, my fiance. But no, you need no, to... no, no words. No more words. Both of you retire to your rooms. Now! Hey, 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 this way. Go to your room. You see what all this is causing? I told you it's not going to work. Oh, Ebubik Dike, please stop complaining. Great kings do marry more than two wives. They have concubines and they keep their home in peace and harmony. That is why Igbo people as their men came against Inona. I expected you to handle that situation as son to be king and not like a common man. Especially talking to that thing you returned with. She's reeking of troubles, arrogance, and pride. Talk to her. I can't do this anymore. Ella has to go. Oh, no. There you go wrong. You and I know that Ella can't leave. You asked for this when you brought that thing into the picture. So stop complaining and fix your home. I should fix it? You heard me. My heart will be more. It is broken. Babe. I'm confused on what I stand on. Am I dreaming? No. Oh, my heart will be more. You know, I called you here especially to thank you for the way you insulted that bitch earlier by addressing her by her godforsaken name. That made me happy so much. And I tell you something, I think I'm beginning to like you. <laughs> thank you. You know what? I shall make you my chief maiden when I become the queen. Thank you, Inko and Queen of Fabugo Kingdom. Thank you so much. Wait. <laughs> Did you just call me the incoming queen? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. No way. No, she addressed me. You addressed me as the incoming queen. <sighs> the incoming queen is delighted. <laughs> okay. I need you to know that the war ahead isn't going to be an easy one. As a matter of fact, I foresee a fierce battle. But I tell you something, we shall not lose God. We shall win. <laughs> and as for that, I do not know. I'm trying to look for the right word to, 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 to qualify. Uh -huh. And as for that foul-mouthed swine of a cook, <laughs> She is already on my bread list. She has earned herself as my enemy. I tell you something, I shall personally treat all her insubordinations when I become the queen. 
You know what? You've actually earned yourself a special gift for addressing me as the incoming queen. Thank you, my lady. You know, a good job deserves a good pay, right? Hola. Come with me. She think you are wise. Dance conclude until God comes fancy. My prince. Well, um... you know, tomorrow will make it three market days since your arrival from the white man's land. Uh, we would want you to make yourself ready to come out to the village square to mourn and to relate with your subjects to be for the upcoming burial. I know people are going to come out in their numbers. This ceremony, according to our tradition, demands that you must ride on the royal chariot. And you must go with your bride-to-be. And that will serve as means of introducing her to our people before the marriage rites commence. I have heard you, my fathers. And I'll be ready tomorrow. Oh, good. You're welcome. <laughs> That's good. Mm. Yeah. Right. <laughs> no, Adora, please, 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 do not make no, me laugh no, so No, 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 no. You are a strong lady. I must say that. <laughs> oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> you wait. You mean the prince has told her that you are his fiance, and she's still there in the palace. So what's she still doing there then? Wasting her time and future. Obviously being engineered by the deceitful queen who sees her as one of her puppets. But you know what? Mm. I could care less. I could bloody care less about them. I tell you something. Mm. Tomorrow is going to be a wonder. The prince is going to be riding with his bride-to-be. You know, he will be officially unveiling his bride-to-be to the people of Abugo Kingdom. And guess who will be riding by his side tomorrow? Don't tell me. Your girlfriend ah! has his fiance. I know, right? Yes! Listen, it's tomorrow. I mean, tomorrow. The people of Abugo Kingdom, we know for sure mm. that that pig is nothing but clouds chasing. Wow. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Lucky you, my friend. You can say that again. The incoming queen of Abugo Kingdom. Yeah, I know, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, you know, this actually calls for celebration. And I'm wondering, we should go out, have some fun to celebrate the incoming queen. Hola, what do you think? <laughs> that would be a great idea, my lady. <laughs> <laughs> right? Well, a quick intro. Okay. All I hear is my most trusted maiden. Mm -hmm. She's very smart, mm -hmm. pretty, and intelligent. Oh. 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 <laughs> Lucky you, Olama, for winning the heart of our next queen of Abugo Kingdom. No, not just Lucky. Mm. I think she's actually highly favored. Yes, you're <laughs> favored. Thank you, ma. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, oh. my lady. So please, can I go and check? Change? Yes, 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 yes. But do not keep the incoming queen waiting. I will not, my lady. Hey, yes! The new incoming! Hey. Hey. Am I not the most beautiful queen to be? You look so adorable, my queen, today. I know, right? <laughs> today I'm going to ride beside you in the royal chariot. Just can't wait for the world to know what a loving woman you've got. I can't wait either. 
<laughs> to show you to the world. <laughs> Get a smile. <laughs> okay. Wow, 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 wow. Look at that. Look at that. Look at you. Hi, right, baby. Let's go. After you, my queen to be. <laughs> Nina, I hope I look ravishing to go on a ride with the prince, my soon-to-be husband, on a royal chariot. You look most ravishing, my lady. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what is this? Move it. Hey, what is it? What is it? Talk, what? Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. Then I can be trusted. Hey, my lady. Mm -hmm. The prince. The prince won't ride that uh, royal um, charot, a uh, royal carrot with that uh, jaga jaga Yvonne. What? As they talk now, two of them, they won't move, they come out. You have to do something about it. Thank you. I hope say you deal with us. Yes, now. Hmm. No fuck up. You gotta watch my lead. If anything won't happen to them, you tell me. Okay. Now me the manager. Yeah? Okay. I'm gonna give you plenty of food. I'm gonna give you four meat. Yeah? Okay. Uh -huh. Open your eyes. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Coleta. Uh -huh. That's my gift. <laughs> You look nice. Thank you. For what occasion are you dressed for? What do you mean, my prince? Am I not supposed to go on a ride with you in the royal chariot? Ella, you know the royal chariot was built for only two passengers. And as you can see, Yvonne here is going with me. My prince, why should I be the one to stay back while Yvonne goes with you? Well, that is because you heard him clearly. The royal chariot is made for two, not for three. You already know three is a crowd. I wasn't talking to you, Miss Arrogant. Learn to speak when you were asked to. You know, I actually know, I actually do understand your frustration and anger. If I were in your shoes, I should feel the same way, Miss Cinderella. Okay, that's enough. Enough. Not now. Ella, you need to understand. Okay? The elders are waiting. Honey, let's go. Is this a frame? Gods? Oh, I am betrayed. Wasting my years. My time. Not anymore, my queen. I am not going to accept your consolation and soothing words. Not anymore. Not when the prince abandoned me and picked that girl for the royal ride. Your majesty, you and I know that whoever rides with the prince today is who the whole people will see as the next queen. I love sweetheart. All that glitters are not gold. You won't understand because you're only but a child. Then make me understand. Your majesty, make me understand because I am running out of patience. In a short while, you will. However, you don't need to bother yourself again because I have everything under my control. I am still the queen of this great kingdom. So, you will join my convoy to the location. Your identity as the next queen is still covered. People will get to see you and me. They will feel the relationship. What else? Come on, relax. I'm almost done, okay? How do I look on this dress? Fabulous, right? 
Yeah, that reminds me, you are mm, looking stunning. I need you to join my convoy. I'm going out. Oh, my lady, I'm about going out to my lady here. How dare you disobey my, disobey my orders? What is Mother. wrong with you? No freaking way you did that. No, no freaking way you laid those cursed fingers of yours on me. She's personally assigned to me, so you do not have any right to hit her. How dare you? The last time I checked, porcupines do not work with maidens. <laughs> and the last time I checked, desperate whores do not live in the palace. No, you didn't say that to me. Did you by any means just call me a desperate whore? Mm -hmm. Desperate me. <gasps> no, you think. The ways of God are Do not allow that wicked queen and her uh, uh, groom, uh, 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 bride and grooming to intimidate you. It's never going to happen, Baba. You have the upper hand and that is the prince's love. Rest assured, you will always stand by to protect you. Trust me. Mother, my phenomenal mother. You know, you do not know that I have been giving you to them fire for fire in our palace. Mm -hmm. oh, they've been feeling the heat. I know. I trust you, my child. Like daughter, like mother. Like I said earlier, I go here. Yeah, Just be giving it to them. This is just the beginning for that wicked queen who has always been the enemy of this family. Let her wait. Once you become the queen of fully, I will show and I'll give it to her. Hot, hot. She will experience. And see my rot. In fact, oh God, I'm mad. I'm not afraid. Who we'll let her lie? My phenomenal mother. Hmm. You do not need to worry. You do not need to bother yourself. In fact, please, can we just stop talking about those inconsequential people? Hmm. Because the last I checked, they do not matter. Yes, mom. On my way, I placed a special request, a special order. Yeah, where's my food? Because I'm famished. How can I forget my precious? Daughter's request. Let me go and arrange the food and serve you like the queen. I'm waiting. Just for one sec, one sec, one sec. <laughs> oh,
Ola. My lady. I will need you to go call that Oyoyo or whatever she's called for me. My lady, it seems to me that you've totally forgotten the reason, the actual reason you were picked from wherever slum that brought you from to this palace. No, my lady. I know they stay for slum. That place where you call just now be like the place where big, big men they stay. Now for Bukai, they stay. Oh. Will you shut that thing you come out, you irritating clown? Listen to me. The kitchen is your only duty post, meaning that I do not want to, for any good reason, see you around parambulating. Hey! Or lazing around. My lady. Especially around that idiot mm. called Emanuela. Did you get that? I get and where where. But that one way speak enter my head. That uh, parambulating. My lady no verse. That one can't remind me that song where they say they just the palambrate, eh? So so story, oh story everywhere, oh, hey. Nepa, don't bring light, oh Nepa, don't bring light, oh. oh. My God, can you just stop clowning? Sorry, my lady. Listen to me. I need you to go to the kitchen and get me a cup of coffee right now. Okay, my lady. Move it. Excuse, my lady. I beg to take my move. Who is this? No, forgot. Just leave. Although it is oh so difficult to like, in the actual world. But it's a way I have to <sighs> What in God's name is this bullshit? I told you to get me coffee and you brought tea. And not just tea, but a watery one. Uh, my lady, no verse. You know, say your, your English, they carry me, they go up, they carry me, they call back. The thing they go on, off, on, off. No verse. I know here yeah, you were. I told you coffee, not tea. Now get on your knees, you bloody moron. You moronic bastard on your knees right now. I said, coffee. Do you know you are nothing but an actual moronic bastard? Now repeat after me. Say you are a moron. You are a moron. No, I say, say you are a moron. Say you are a moron. You should say you is a moron. You should say you is a moron. Really? Really? Oh, yeah, I see you. Daddy bastards! I need you to have a taste of your bullshit! Drink this, bro! Drink this! Idiots! Now get out! My sons. Get out! <laughs> I'm so sorry, okay? <laughs> my mother, they me. Oh my 
Aladia, I understand how you feel. It's okay. Trust me. Soon she'll be more and more than celebrated. <laughs> oh. Your Majesty, are you planning on killing her? Maybe God forbid. Never. I can't have her blood in my hands. Not to worry. Hmm? You won't understand now, but soon you will. They say he who loves last, loves best. <laughs> My prince, now that the burial of your late father, our late king, has been successfully concluded according to our tradition, one thing is left before your coronation as our king, the king of Apugo Kingdom. And that thing is your marriage with her chosen bride, uh, which must be concluded before the next two moons. So, we need to know your preferred date for a traditional marriage. And you are choosing bride. Since we know you have two awaiting brides in the picture, who are Emanuela and Yvonne? Well, I will make my answer direct and brief as possible. I have chosen the one that is after my heart, amongst the two women. And that is the lady I return with from abroad, Yvonne. Well said, my prince. We have to commence your marriage preparations without further delay. So at least we have someone to occupy our throne. Hmm? Um, my fellow elders. Hello. Have I spoken your mind? Yes, yeah, yes or no? Before you that, I will. Maria! <laughs> oh, greetings, uh, uh, Her Majesty, the Queen of uh, Abuko Kingdom. 
Why are you skulking around my household? What are you doing here? Hee hee! Hey, Bobo Sigoro. Get scooping around. If there is anyone that is scooping around here, that person is you. Because you can see, I am coming from my daughter's chambers. She's living upstairs. And you're downstairs. Because I know you don't have any business up there. And let me remind you once more. I have every right to come into this palace as I wish. Without any permission, no interruption. Not even from you. <laughs> they soon to be Ogonwai. Maria, this game you are playing will certainly consume you. Trust me. Eh. How? When I'm already winning, can't you see my daughter's wedding with your son? It's pretty coming soon. I have laughed last. <laughs> Mrs. Queen. Don't rejoice yet. Uh, I believe. A day boom, a boom. A da boom, a boom. Can run in, can run on So do not rejoice yet until it is finally over. Hmm. Mano nya for the zebo nya chiroch. For now, I'll be seeing you, sir. Agomai. Like I told you earlier, I am the winner. The wedding is coming. See you soon. I'm seeing you. 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 I'
Come yes. realize. Come ratify. Say now you be the original wife. You go come back to you. Now I make them say person will laugh last. Now I laugh best. You are not say now you go laugh last. Bube, mm -hmm. Jesus to me everything. No cry, yo. You know, say your cry, they make me cry. If you cry, you go make me cry. They showed me. She said, If you cry, come back. No, no, no go cut to Wahala. When? Ella. My daughter. If I am truly your daughter, then why all this? Ella. What has made you angry this time? Everything. Everything around you, your majesty. How? How could you do this to me? Why didn't you tell me that your son, the prince, has already presented that intruder to the royal cabinet members as his chosen bride? And I was there banking on your assurances and empty promises. Why? Why are you toying with my head and my emotions? Why this emotional betrayal? <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I've seen why you're boiling up. Hello, darling. Nothing has changed. My words as a queen is my bond. And I am reassuring you that you must be the queen of this Abogo kingdom. Swearing by Ajakaja, the god of this great Abogo kingdom, that I must keep to my promise. Only patience. Just patience, my dear. Patience? Yes. Patience to say, Your Majesty. You heard me. For how long? For how long, Your Majesty? When it is obvious that the prince is slipping off my grip. When it is clear that I am the, the, the fool here. You're not. And you can never be the loser. Just watch and see how the whole thing will work perfectly in your favor. Just be wise. Okay? The great queen of Abogo kingdom. Patience is the saddle of the brave. Come, Emanuela. My sweet girl, only time. Just a little time will feed your worries and curiosity. You don't need to worry. I am with you. We're in this together. Right? And we're doing it. Relax. And other ways of men. I understand how you feel, son. It's nobody's fault. For the decision of the guards of the land and must be obeyed. I encourage you take the elders advice and uh, pick another bride to pay the price. Mother, do you realize you're asking me to commit murder? You don't have a choice. Pick another bride to be the sacrificial lamb. 